Acting Prime Minister of Armenia Nikol Pashinyan again expresses an unwillingness to meet with the candidate for the post of Secretary General of the Collective Security Treaty Organization Stanislav Zas. All countries of the organization except Armenia endorsed the candidacy of the representative of Belarus for the post of CSTO Secretary General. In the opinion of the military political scientist from Belarus, Alexander Tikansky, the position of the acting Prime Minister of Armenia at the present time is not of great importance for the rest of the organization's member countries. Pashinyan's position in this case is of no interest to anyone. Since already at two meetings, he refused to resolve the issue on the CSTO Secretary General. The last time was on December 6, when he asked to postpone this period. I think that in January there won't even be such a meeting. This simply increases the time, and only the question will drag on and go to the latent side. Therefore, here the position will be consolidated by all countries, and apparently the CSTO countries will also have to break the rules of consensus and make decisions by a majority vote. According to Azerbaijani political scientist Arsene Nagiev, Armenia's actions have caused great damage to the organization's image. Pashinyan thought that the representative of Armenia could be the secretary general of the CSTO, but this did not happen. Kazakhstan and Belarus were against this. And most importantly, Russia was against all of this. By solving this issue, Armenia has achieved that the CSTO has lost its image. It should be noted that the post of the CSTO secretary general became vacant after the removal from this post of the representative of Armenia, Yuri Kachaturov, who is accused of overthrowing the constitution in his homeland.